A welcome back. An ugly move at a local art store after an art heist from a Midtown Sacramento store last week. Tonight we're hearing from the artist who created unusual handmade pieces that have now been stolen and getting a look at the thief caught on camera. So he came in through here. Broken glass and a boarded up window after a thief smashed through the front door of the University Art Store on J Street in Midtown Sacramento. So this is the two rocks that he used to throw through the window. A witness caught the burglar on camera last Thursday going inside and stealing two sculptures on display in the front window created by Sacramento artist Chris Bales. It, it made me very sad. The two pieces are steampunk inspired three dimensional hanging sculptures about two and a half feet tall. They're mixed media assemblage pieces and they're made out of found objects. Sacramento police say they arrested the suspect, 32 year old Andrew Shorgen, a day later, but he didn't have the art on him. They've been trying to get him to tell them where the sculpture is, but he hasn't. He won't tell. Chris has posted flyers looking for the stolen sculptures and friends, neighbors and fellow artists are out combing nearby streets and alleys trying to find the unusual looking sculptures. We'll be on on the look for it. We'll, we'll see if we can find it and help this person out. They could be lost. They could have been sold. It could be sitting behind a bush someplace. You know, we just don't know. The theft comes at a terrible time for Chris. He was an employee at University Art for 24 years and just lost his job when the a long time Sacramento store permanently closed earlier this month. It's a lot to take on all at once. But he's hopeful his missing art will eventually be found. I'm really impressed with the community, how they're really out there helping and trying to find it and uh, maybe we can bring them home. I sure hope they find them. Chris says the sculptures take months to make and similar ones have sold in art galleries for up to $2,000 each.